So what if I told you that there's an easier way to learn how to airbrush? Sure, you're still gonna have to put in the time and practice, but in this video, I'm gonna reveal something that I've designed that's gonna make all that so much easier. Let's get into it right now. So you may have already seen lots of these artworks on our YouTube channel. So these are some of the tutorials that I feature here. And these are all definitely possible with some practice, especially when you get into the more detailed artworks like the cassowary, images like this eye. It definitely becomes more challenging airbrushing things like this but before attempting all these sorts of artworks like this you really need a good foundation to start your airbrushing journey and that foundation can definitely be found in our online course so sure you can search through well over 300 videos that we currently have on our channel that'll definitely help you create artworks like this but it's the basics and the fundamentals of airbrushing that are so so important and you really need that toolkit which is what the online course becomes in order to achieve creating artworks like this. It doesn't matter what you're gonna be airbrushing, whether it's detailed automotive artworks, you're rendering miniatures, you're doing RC cars, body painting, special effects, whatever it may be, the foundation is always the most important part. And in the online course, I cover all of the fundamentals and all the basics that are necessary when attempting to create any particular airbrush artwork. The course is split up into three main sections. So you've got all your basic training, then you've got special effects. So it's a little bit more advanced just to get you into the feel of creating some more detailed artworks. And the tips that you learn within the special effects will then be carried through to the final project, which is a black and gray skull and a color skull. The reason I do skulls is not only are they super popular, but it also gives you a basis for learning how to create something that is tackled very similar to to a portrait, even though a portrait has a lot more finesse needed. But because this is a beginner or an introductory airbrush course, I like to keep it very simple. And the skull allows you to make a mistake and you can turn that into a crack. You can black out a tooth. You can add a bit more texture and learn how to hide any mistakes that you may make. Whereas if it was say a portrait or something that needs that accuracy, then that's gonna be a level up. And those sorts of things will definitely be coming in future courses. The other great thing about the course is as well as it being extremely organized so it's run in the same fashion as the course that I used to teach face to face you also have all of your reference images that you can download in regular resolution or high res for your tablet phone computer and you can also print those references out if need be and then later on in the exercises you'll find cutting maps that you can print and what I've done is I've actually highlighted where you should cut out your paper templates so that you can create the feature artworks being that black and white and color skull. The course is also a one-time purchase so there's no ongoing fees, no memberships, nothing like that. You pay for it once you've got access for life. At the time of filming this video the course is $199 US dollars and I also offer an Australian dollar option and that can be purchased through our site direct and you've got to allow about say 24 hours for me to go in and activate those enrollments so just be patient if you do go for the Australian dollar option. Option. Don't panic, I generate all of the coupons manually, so then you'll be emailed an access coupon once your enrollment has been confirmed. Any payments made directly on the platform using the US dollars will have direct access. So as soon as you pay for it, you're up and running and you can start learning as soon as possible. The course will also save your progress until you reach that 100% completion, but once you've reached that, you can always go back and revise any section that you wish. And that's why I make it nice and clear that this is really an essential toolkit that you'll keep going back to throughout your airbrushing journey. And it's super important to keep practicing, especially those basic exercises, because that is really gonna be your way of fast tracking your airbrushing. I know everyone wants to do all these really fantastic looking artworks, but it's those basic fundamentals that will allow you to do so. So I recommend you always go back and practice those. Even if you do them before every time you go and paint as a bit of a warm up exercise, I highly recommend that. The other main feature that you will get is a discussions tab within the course, and that gives you direct access to me. So if you're say getting stuck within one of the special effects exercises, you can actually upload your photo of where you're at, submit your question, and it'll relate directly to the lesson that you're in and then I will get an email, I'll answer that within the platform 
platform and you'll get a response really quickly as I check all of those questions daily. If you need a little bit more convincing, then by all means, check out the reviews that some of our students have already left that have really been enjoying the course and using all of that information to fast track their airbrushing. And for any further info, or if you do wanna check it out, the link is in the description below. Go have a look for yourself. There's a free preview section and you'll get a taste for what it's all about. If you have any questions regarding the course, by all means, leave them in the comments below. And I look forward to seeing you in the course very, very soon and helping you improve your airbrushing. So to continue your learning, be sure to check out some of the other videos and playlists that I've got listed here. And for more info on the course, or if you wish to enroll, jump in the description below and you'll find that link there. And until next time, go grab your airbrush, do some amazing artwork yourself, and I'll see you again very, very soon in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.